the next step is to perform the trimming if the quality of the sequence is bad if there are any raptor sequences if they have any sort of limitation in the sequencing sequencing data what you do is to perform trimming of the of the fastq file so that you get a good or better quality fastq file for the analysis so for that what you need to do is to is to install trimomatic and for trimomatic you just if you write install trimomatic command uh, how to install trimomatic and when you click it you can see the three steps like you can just write this command here and it will automatically install the trimomatic here so uh, and then what you have to do like uh, we have a sequ uh, we uh, we have downloaded a lot of uh, fastq files if i just show you here for instance we have a lot of files like these are the new fastq files here you can see that there are a lot of fastq files so we will perform fastq uh, trimming uh, for one of the sequence and you can see how it can be done i've already run this command for your ease so that you can see uh, uh, how it can be done so this is the this is the command here here you can see that uh, trim a trimomatic package is installed in uh, user share java folder here this jar file is present so for that the data is single end sequencing so for that you need to have single end sequencing command like first you need to write java then minus jar then the 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 location of the of the trimomatic jar file and then single end sequencing and after that you have to write the the location like where the file is saved so here you can you if you want to like just to show you that if you want to change the file but uh, this is very straightforward like right? for example just for you like if i just change the so these are the there's a list of files right you can you can uh, put any of those files here for for example err four double zero double seven zero three dot fastq file right this is the input sequence fastq file which we want to trim the next one is the output file here you can write output file or output uh, output new right and then this is the uh, this is the this is the command which is used here that is uh, illumina clip right this is the one command of this uh, which is which is present in this trimomatic package and then uh, this is the true seek 3-se.fa fastq file fasta file here there are the adapter sequences are present in this file and you can actually trim those if the adapter sequences are present in this file it will trim these or clip these sequences and then this is the standard command here you can write reading 3 trailing 3 and then sliding window or also you can write here fred 64 or fred 63 and then you can just uh, minimum length is 36 and you can just enter it right so now here you can see the command is run uh, started to run here so the file this is the arguments which we have passed and uh, uh, automatically it is using four threads using long uh, these are the two adapter or clipping sequences which it will check in the file and after checking the file right so these are two clip uh, sequences so after checking the file it will save it into the into this output new fastq file right um, and uh, yes and these are all the information that is available and the quality encoding detected as fred 33 right so now the file the 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 command is running and it is actually making or generating a new output which has which uh, with the name of out q output underscore new right and this is saved here in new fast queue. if i if we go here and we can see here that this uh, output new file is actually saving here so the size is very small light like right now 10 bytes because currently the file is running and when it will be done it will sh uh, it will be saved here in the fast queue file so let's wait for a while and then uh, we uh, we will come back with the results so now the uh, file file is run and uh, has run uh, and the, these are the total surviving uh, reads and these are the drop reads 
99.85% and 99.85% file is the fine file. So the, the, the results are now is saved. So if now if you want to check the uh, fast queue, right, for instance, we want to uh, run the fast queue file. What we can do here is we can just use the uh, graphical user interface here. And here we can now go and and uh, from here where the file is saved that place we are going here in MNT uh, new fastq files here you can see these are new fastq files in the end is a new output like this one right so we can just select the file and it will load and uh, then it will share the uh, result with us so let's see uh, whether the quality of the file whether the adapter sequences are removed or not just for a quality check if not then what you can do is now there are different types of for instance here you can see that it's using fred 33 right so there's another way you can check it by changing the it fred 64 and maybe the 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 uh, you can run it again and you can see that whether the whether the results are fine or not and if again the results are not coming good it means the the fast queue file is very poor and uh, it will be difficult to, uh, to improve the quality of the file so now it's almost 75 percent done let's see what we have uh, here So yes, so now it's all it's done. Hey, now you can see that the adapter, the green represents that the quality is good, right? Yellow represents that it is not very good but acceptable. Cross represents that it is <coughs> not good. So the here you can see that adapter sequences are removed, and if you see the previous uh, video I have shared, you can see the fast queue quality of adapter sequences were not good, but in this after trimming it it is now showing that the quality of the sequence is good. So this is the next step. Uh, so after performing the trimming now the files are ready for our next expression analysis and i will share the next steps in the next uh, video thank you bye bye